Hey guys, Brito here. Welcome back to Fishing Barren Sea. Here we are, still again in our Hermes. Um, out trawling a little bit more. So we're going to get our boat going and turn to the left a little bit. Try and go with these waves because they're pretty rough at the moment. Plenty of fish on board. Um, which way are we going? We'll head. Uh, let's head directly to the south, I think, is the way that we need to go. Uh, these guys are a little bit tired, but we're going to need to set the trawl again. Slow ourselves right down. Go back into here, jump out of this seat, back into this seat. I'm going to set the trawl net. Now I'm going to do something that I've seen um, somebody else do, which he just set the nets down to 35 metres and off he went and he got a heap of fish so um, we'll see see what we can do I suppose um, you go back there back there back there you go there I know you're not going to cook for long but All right, stop both I think that one in a little bit and see what we can do. 2.6 knots. There's a lot of fish here. That's 302 meters down. So we've got 180 clearance to the sea floor. Which it does actually seem like. We can jump out of the seat, but it's pretty shallow here. No, 400 meters, so it's not overly shallow. Not getting any fish at all, though, so. Bit of a shame. Let's um, oops, reel it back out, not in. Try and get some of this down here. Don't know if it's going to happen, but we'll wait and see. So he's gutting 900 an hour. They're not stacking as much as he's gutting, but freezing, I should say. And they're stacking 477, so a little bit less than they are. Um, getting low on fuel. It's cooking away. Let's keep an eye on this. There we go. Seven, and then it stops. Keep going down a little bit further. So you can still see it. It's right down here below us. We'll try and get that net deep. Plenty of fish down there at the moment, which is good. Let's hope we can actually get onto the fish. That's the main thing. Definitely, once our clearance gets close to zero, I want to make sure we don't go any lower. That way, we know we're sort of um, scraping the bottom of the sea floor. Um, I think the ship's turned a little bit, so we'll try and turn back to the right a bit more. Not too much. There you go, so we're 50 metres clearance, still dropping. Goes up and down a fair bit with the boat. I think we'll stop about now. Hopefully we can grab some of this. Yeah, so about 14 metres from the bottom. So if we go to 160, then we'll stop it again and see what happens. Um, we haven't got our... No. Troll speed, symmetry. Troll speed's out. Uh, distance is out as well for some strange reason. Uh, let's bump up our troll speed. So there's plenty of stuff down here which we should really be getting because their clearance is only 15 metres from the bottom. So 
mean, we should really be getting all this stuff. Once again, doesn't seem like we're getting anything at the moment. These noisy bloody seagulls. Um, I don't think there's been an update anytime soon, or anytime recently, I should say. Uh, Ruth's too tired to work, that's fine. You'll be pretty tired soon, too, aren't you? So we're still not getting anything at all. Which is a little bit frustrating. Um, I want to try and turn back towards the south. Of course, the boat always gets dragged to the left. And I'm going to start to reel these in. To see if we can find anything on the way back up. So there's not much there. Oh, there we go. We're getting something now. We'll stop the reeling, just in case. Nine from somewhere. As I said, I don't know where we're getting it from. Are we getting it from here or from somewhere else? Right, that's a great catch. Wherever we're getting it from, I don't care. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's a shame. I thought it was going to go really dark then. Alright, let's continue to reel it in. Get another pickup like that, I'll be pretty bloody happy. He's going to be very tired soon. All these guys are really struggling with their stamina. Going to bump up the speed just a little bit, not too much. Still can't see anything on the screen at the moment. Right, it's still sort of twisting to the left a little bit, but it's not doing too bad. I still hope they're going to do some sort of update to allow us to have maybe bigger ships like this, but to be able to um, use long lines and nets again instead of having to go trawling if we don't want to, because the trawling for me is just um, terrible. Stop the nets. Let's pump up the speed a little bit. I just still really struggle with trawling. Like there's, we're getting four fish, but from where? There's nothing even here. Now we're getting five. We're getting it from here, and then we get nothing again. So, so this is one of those things where, it, from what we're seeing here to what we get here, doesn't always match up for me. I don't know if it's me not understanding it properly, as I've said before, or if it's just, I don't know, that hard to work out. Got to quickly click on something. There we go. Olav is too tired to work. He would be. These guys wouldn't be far off either. How are we going? There's nothing there at the moment. We got. We got it. Four guys that'll be able to help us haul in the trawl. So if we get you all back over to here, get ready once the net's within 25 meters. There you go. Bring it in. We'll see what we can get. Should be fairly full. So it should be. Should be pretty good. Hopefully it'll fill us right up. I don't know about 63,000, but we'll see. So would you guys like me to stick with um, trawling, or would you like me to go back to using the long line or the nets? You guys leave it in the comment section and let me know. Um, I'd love to use a ship of this size with you know this capacity to be able to go um, long lining and net hauling and stuff. It would be a lot better. So still raising the trawl net. And then now we'll get ready to empty it. Do what the captain does, go ahead and have a good look. Quick screenshot. Storage is full, that's good. So we got Pollock, Haddock and Redfish. Beautiful. Boat is chockers. Try and get back inside. 
So now we can go back to this. Um, you can go back to gutting. You guys can continue to rest. Alright. We need to head. Are we in the port? Thought we were already returned to port. Oh, no, there we go. For some reason. Didn't have us returned to port. Alright, so he's got 154,000 kilos of gut. I don't think he's going to get it done anytime soon. GPS. Could probably go here, but I'm not going to go there. We're going to head back down. All the way down through here. There we go. And go. Fast travel. Right, keep an eye on you. You might as well. Um, so, I'm trying to keep these guys in order. Alright, beautiful. Continue to fast travel so this other guy is too tired. How are these guys now resting up? Not too bad. Give them another couple of hours. There we go, we did click exit. It's waiting for it to load. Hopefully it hasn't frozen on us. Come on. Oop, there we go. Yep, come on. Resume. There we go. Um, still, you're resting. You can go there. He's still working his butt off, that guy. Alright, continue to fast travel. Now, how are people going? Need you really just to get back to work, I think. So let them keep fast travelling. Yeah, there seems to be a few issues here for some reason. There you go. Sander is too tired to work. So he can go down to there. You're still cooking away, which is good. Still gutting, there's still a lot of fish to gut, so. Hare is too tired to work. Uh, so are you, you two can both eat. You're still doing okay, you're resting. Right, we're not going to sell anything at the moment, we're going to skip two hours. How are you guys going now? Resting, back into stacking. Go back into there, you're still cooking, which is good. Oops, wrong button. Still gutting, so we can go and rest. We'll go through another four hours. Still working away. So they're probably only going to get through another like an hour and a half, I would say. Or three hours even, so we'll just go through another four. Oh, they're still going. It's just about finished. You're just about finished too. Go to repair. Skip through another four hours. So they're all. So you're idle now. You haven't got anything to do. Um, you can eat. You can cook. Let's skip through. Let's go 24 hours this time. There you go. Now they're too tired to work. Um, you're there. Olaf, you can go. Where's Ruth there? So you're there. You're there. You guys can all eat. You can go idle, idle. So you're not doing anything at all. 
Well, actually, you can go there. Just, you need the stack. Go into here. We're gonna skip forward another, say, four hours. Both resting. We'll get you back out. You can go and rest. You can go back into there. Skip through. Let's go 12 hours. Um, whoops. That's why I hate editing videos while I'm playing at the same time. Um, oh, it's you two. You can go back into there. You're resting, so you can stay there. You can go into there. Skip through. Let's just go six hours. You can go back and rest. Back and rest. You two can come back in. Skip through another six hours. Still not quite done. You can go back to stacking. You can go to stacking as well and just go through another two hours to make sure we're done. Still not done. Two hours. Now we're done. Okay, you can go to there, you can go to here. You can go back to cook. So you can go to repair. Um, head on in. So now we're going to make. Wow, not much money at all. 2.2 .2 or a million or 1.5. 4.6. So we didn't make much money out of that. That's. Uh, weird, actually. Um, we've still got a lot of debt. Uh, we don't need any of that stuff. We can go to the dock. We can buy fuel. 3.2 million it's going to cost us for fuel. Um, Pollock, Haddock, and Redfish. So we didn't make much money at all then, which is really strange. 1.8, 1.4 mackerel 4 million so we're making 6 million so it's not too bad I suppose but still not great um, how much fuel have we got half a tank so that should be enough for us to do what we need to um, I think we'll go with that upgrade now I've only got 2 million left so the radar doesn't mean anything at the moment because we've already unlocked everything. Um, we can buy fuel. I think let's just buy, say, 2 million kroners worth. Um, where are we at the moment? What's going on? Um, haddock season. Might, might skip through a week, um, then go through another day to 1am on the 9th and see. Cod prices increased by 20% and haddocks down. Go through another week. Yeah, so cod prices are up. It's not a great deal going on at the moment. Skip through 30th of the night. First. Cod prices are up by 20% still. How's our ship? Not looking very good. You can go back to repair. She can go back to cooking. Um, who's a good repairer? You might as well do it. Bjart. Bjart. Um, we'll go skip one week. Have a look now. What do we got? Prices of, for mackerel and redfish are both up. So we're not getting mackerel, but we are getting redfish. Um, 
1375, so it's still not great money to be honest. Terrible money. Um, we're going to have to go out and fish though because we're going to run out of money. Um, how's our boat looking? Not too bad. You can go back to repair. You can start backing out. Turn ourselves around. So now we've got 320,000 kilos. So 320 tons of meat. So we can turn ourselves around pretty easy here and then head back out. So we nearly filled up the boat, not quite, but... Alright, head right up the top. Fast travel. Which isn't very fast. All species, how about the cod? Redfish. There's almost redfish around, but there's plenty of cod. Plenty of cod in there. Alright, we'll move forward a bit, hopefully. We'll get the little icon come up in a second. Maybe. Maybe not, so we'll just do a loop. Sometimes we have to do for it to actually come up. There we go. Um, let's head to the west this time. Doesn't matter who we use for this, just use the top four guys. So we'll head directly to the west. Small amount of speed into it. Jump out of there, jump into this seat, drop the lines, it's a little bit right there, so wait for these guys to finish setting the trawl and then we'll, there we go, put them back to resting, it's pretty good freezing, he's good machine cutting and stacking, 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 you're good at cooking now. So really want to get some of this fish that's right in front of us if we can. Wait and see what happens. So I think we're probably going to get some of this stuff, so... If we maybe go down to the 65 meters and then there you go, and hopefully we get something. We should this stuff should come straight towards us. I hope we should pick it up. And the boat's heading back to the left again, as it always bloody does. Um, everything looks pretty good. Still not picking anything up at the moment, but we should get this eventually. I'll pop the speed just a little bit and then we can drop it back once we start getting fish in the net. There's nothing coming in at the moment. These lights are way too bright. I think we still need to dim them down a little bit. It's not very often we get absolutely nothing straight away. I'm trying to see if we can get some of this. We've got doors just right above it, so it would be pretty good if we could. I don't know if we're going to get any though. Ship's still turning to the left. We don't want it to. Still not getting anything at the moment. It's really frustrating. 
symmetry is well and truly out. Height is 5.42 and opening is 1.27. 4.20 from the seabed floor. Getting nothing at all. Ah, let the net back down here. We missed that, obviously. Let's see if we can grab some of this down here. Sort of going to our left, that stuff. Might still grab a little bit of it if we're lucky, but... I don't think it's going to happen. We needed to been moving to our left earlier. Hold the left button on the on the arrows. Let's see if we can move over to the left and grab a little bit of it. But I really don't think we're gonna no, we're gonna get absolutely nothing. It's frustrating. I'm just gonna go flat stick now. There we go, now we're getting something. Not a lot, but... Trawling like crazy. Look to the left and see what we can get. Still getting five. Okay, let's drop back to nothing now. Just let it go and see what happens, I guess. Try not to worry about it. Let's let him go, let it happen. Head back to the west. There's a little bit over here. Let's head this way. See if we can pick it up. Sort of move over this way a bit. Not sure if we're going to get it, but we'll find out. It's only 28 meters off the seabed. Now it's slowly rising because our nets are coming up because we're going so fast, but we're on for a little bit of fish there. Alright, let's slow ourselves right down. Okay, we're on the fish. And now we're off it again. Ah. Let's move back to the left. Try and get the nets to come over this way again a little bit more. Got, we should have some whales over here somewhere. There they are. We'll see them on the sonar. There we go. We're on the fish again. Looks like we're getting off them again. Still on for a four, so we're not far off. That catch is about 80%. Alright, we're just going to go flat out, turn, and then start reeling them in. Keep heading back to the south to try and to scoop all this up. Not 
on absolutely nothing at the moment. Still trying to turn to the south. Doesn't want to turn anymore. We're on the fish again. I think our nets are probably chockers at the moment. I'm just going to shut the boat down and hope for the best, I think. Um, hopefully we definitely should have a full net's worth, whatever that capacity is. We're still on the fish. We're going backwards. Let's go forwards. It's the net dragging us backwards. You don't want to go backwards because you don't want to lose fish out of the net if that's even a thing. Alright, so you guys can get ready to haul the trawl. Right on a good bit of fish here at the moment. It's a shame our nets are already chock a block. definitely on the fish which is it's frustrating we're already full and we're still getting so much fish oh, so we're going we're going four knots slow it down a little bit there we go Let's see what we get with this haul let's go out and have another look watch the guys in action More screenshots, might as well. It's a big fish sausage. Bring it up, we'll see what's in there, and then we'll call it an end of the episode, I think. Big fish sausage. Show me the money. Hopefully we start getting some cod, because cod's worth the most still, I think. We did 24,000 tons of cod. 24,000 pollock. 33,000 haddock. And 18,000 redfish. Oh, there's that bloody pop-up again. Okay. Right, let's get back inside. Sit back in our seat. And you guys, you can go to there. You can go to there. And you two guys can go over there and do what we need to do. So that's 100,000. So we're two more of those, two more in a bit, and we're going to have a full boat, which is going to be good. So that's a lot. We've got a lot more haddock than anything else, but that's awesome. That was actually a pretty good um, haul, I think. Ooh, 19. I'd like to see 19. That'd be pretty good. So if you guys enjoyed it, as always, smash that like button. Leave a comment. As I said, let me know if you want to continue see me continue trawling or go back to long line or nets or whatever. You guys let me know. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. Hit that subscribe button. Spritos Gaming. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.